Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to our channel. Welcome to another one of our videos. Today we're going to talk about Virgin Galactic. We'll discuss the updated analysts and new short interest reports. And we'll look at our positions and review the charts. And we'll also discuss what the options are telling us. If you're new to our channel, go ahead and click any of the money icons below to review our past videos. Please smash that like button and subscribe. So let's get busy. Uh, currently, we only have 200 shares of Virgin Galactic, and we picked up a total of $764 in the past, and our premiums are minus uh, $153 so far in this position because we still have 200 shares open. Our premiums of profit so far this month for October is $54.03. Our total profits uh, after the capital loss and the margin fees is $49. 75 that's a total of 3.45 percent return so far this month we got one more week virgin galactic it's been going down 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 lately now friday it closed at a volume of about 8.5 million shares versus the average volume of 15.3 million we're looking at a market cap of about five billion dollars which i think it should be a lot higher our low side is 15 dollars and our high side is 50. Our average analyst report is 28.91. Short increase increased from 915 to 930, from 26.8 million to 28.9 million shares. Almost 29 million shares, which therefore increases the shorts of 15% of the stock is over 15% of the stock is shorted. So we can get a short squeeze anytime whenever there's news. I'll place this article down below. Virgin Galactic delays commercial flight launch report. This is this another update. It's talking about a, it comes after a routine test revealed a possible reduction in the strength margins of certain materials used as VWS Eve and VSS Unity Craft. So in order to make sure that this aircraft is sound, uh, they have to go through inspections and then they have to replace parts on these aircraft. The CEO of the aerospace company said while this new lab test data has had no impact on the vehicles, our test flight protocols have clearly defined strengths margins, and further analysts will assess whether any additional work is required to keep them at or above established levels. The analysts said the scheduled slippage and potential technical issues highlighted and the inherent risks around flight testing, we view it positively that the company is investing in increasing its long-term space flight capacity. However, these investments take time, sometimes more than anticipated. So they've been adjusting their, their price targets on their stock as well. I'll place this article down below so you can read the whole item. And then there was a, another downgrade from UBS to sell. They think the shares could dip another 25%, uh, down to around $15 a share from the current levels. So I'll place this article as well down below from this analyst report. Let's cover the options real quick. These are the calls up here. These are the weekly options come expiring on the 29th of October. As you can see, there's about, about 15 million shares of open interest here. Plus there's some volume to it that would increase it as well. So it's a little bit higher. The calls outrank the puts almost about two to one. But I still think there's some pain ahead. You know, the they short sellers are thinking it's going to go down to the $15 level. I don't think it's going to go down there that quick myself. So I'll be looking at some of these to sell some puts to get back into the position in the future. So I'm just going to keep an eye on the stock for a while. I'm not going to take any action. Let's go ahead and look at the chart. As you can see, we're way below the 200-day and the 50-day moving average. We dipped way down here. The next drop could put us down here at the 1550 level. That's where the shorts think we're going. And if that's the case, that's probably going to be where I'm going to start buying at. 
but I'm only gonna you know dip my toe into it a little bit at a time just in case he goes further down because it's gonna be a while before we get an aircraft in the air just keep that in mind I appreciate everybody watching the video today and if you have any questions or comments or share your position with us place them down below please smash that like button and subscribe to our channel so you can get our future content enjoy your weekend out there until next time this is sunny I'm out